Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to test the microwave transformer. We have to open the screw for these two screw for Magitron and then remove it so we can be able to to have access to to test the transformer and remove these terminals. But uh, firstly, we have to discharge the the capacitor before you test anything and now we have to remove this terminal from from the capacitor and that one from from the transformer that one is for that uh, high voltage fuse and also remove the primary wires that are connected to transformer i'm struggling to to get it so i can see clearly as you can see i removed this these two terminals and now I set my, on my my multimeter to to continue with it. that is the easiest way to test the the transformer. This must have beep. And now when we test this primary trans terminals, we must get a beep. If there's no beep, then the power doesn't go to to the secondary. Now we're gonna have a, we must have a reading or also the beep. Then the terminals are fine if you don't get anything if you don't get uh, the continuity or or any number then the primary this primary side is it's not working doesn't transport the power to the secondary Now, also, when you test this uh, microphone terminal, you have to get the beep and also the, the number. Then it means the transformer is working perfect fine. So, you must also scratch, as you can see, you have to scratch when you test that terminal um, on that voltage terminal, high voltage fuse terminal also the board as you can see we have to get the beep also or the the number sometimes sometimes you don't get the beep you can go maybe gonna get one few you see as you so you have to scratch it if you didn't scratch it you won't get any number because that thing is glued it have glue so you see now on that when you scratch it when I get access to get a uh, to get the, the rating I'm very sorry to take uh, so long. I'm trying to get pro the the space 
because I'm other side I'm holding the phone and other side uh I'm holding the the the, the multimeter probe. As you can see, all right. I'm trying to get a beep, not a number. So now we try. Is reading the the diode. I want to read the num the the sound, the continuity. As now I'm gonna. If it is faulty, that's how you test. You see, there's no number. There's no beep. So. It's not faulty, it's nothing, there's no reading, there's no reading, as you can see, no reading, because it's not shorted inside, if it's shorted, you'll get a reading. Now, as you can see, there's no reading. Also, on the other side, there's no reading. So I, I connect the, the negative probe to to the terminals of a Megatron so that they can so that you can see if it's shorted or not. As you can see, I'm very sorry about this. I'm struggling sometimes. This one now I connected to this one with this probe. And sometimes you have to read my my description my when I, I'm describing any everything when I post my videos so that you can under, also understand how to test and how do you check and please don't forget to check my book on Amazon everything is in there please share subscribe and check my book on Amazon thank you very much bye.